Hey, what is up, everybody? I'm going to take hey, this jacket Hey, what is up, everybody? This is Stevie Breach coming to you here today as we are sitting here with another WWE Shop unboxing. I just did the uh, Black Friday one last week, and I said in that video, there's another one coming, because in that time, WWE ran a 50% off t-shirt sale, and I jumped all over it. I said in this year's video, the Black Friday sale honestly wasn't the best deals that they've ran in a long time. I was grateful uh, to to pick up a, a few Blu-rays that are still sitting right here. I uh, haven't opened them yet. SummerSlam, Hardcore, and the Attitude Era Volume 3 completing that set. But the t-shirts I'm pumped up for. I haven't bought shirts, honestly, in a long time. I can't remember if I bought any shirts at WrestleMania this year or if I just bought them beforehand, but that's probably the last time. Well, I got that AJ Styles shirt in there, but I haven't remember the last time I got a bunch of shirts. Um, so I'm really excited for that. Um, I'm going to link uh, the Black Friday one uh, down below in case you missed it. This one's a, not a huge order, but it is four shirts. So it is a, a good number of shirts. Um, $61 uh, for the shirt. So um, $12.49 a piece, it looks like they're, they, they all cost. So this one basically um, should have uh, caught... Um, one shirt I should have bought at WrestleMania, but I thought about it, but... I might as well call this the NXT Shop Unboxing, because um, even though these guys aren't in NXT anymore, I wanted the shirt when they were NXT, so that, that, that's why I bought it. We'll start out with that one, since we've already talked about it so much. Um, when, when we went running in uh, to the uh, WWE WrestleMania Superstore, one of the highlights for any wrestling fan going to WrestleMania, no matter if you've been one time, five times, ten times, the Superstore basically is our Walmart. It is it is the, you know, wall-to-wall -wall packed. It is huge. Tons of people in there, but nothing but wrestling merch from side to side. And if you're somebody like my buddy Justin, um, you wanted that Dean Ambrose jacket for the longest time when you saw it on WWE Shop, but you just really wanted, honestly, to touch it, feel it, try it on. That's what it's there for. But I went running in to the uh the superstore and i was looking to see if these guys were going to have a, sh a shirt american alpha they still haven't won um the uh, smackdown tag team championships but these guys are a fucking awesome team jordan and gable i almost bought the towel uh but i just knew honestly what the hell what the hell am i gonna do with that uh do we need another spank rag um underneath the bed for somebody to find or something like that but american alpha this isn't the best shirt in the world, um, but it is a cool one to wear uh, to the gym. And anybody who's a wrestling fan, um, who has guys that you really want to support, and you know that you're going to be fans of them for a long time, you want to be able to say that you have their first shirt. And and this was it. Um, I saw this on the sa uh, on this on the store shelf um, for uh, twenty five bucks, and just didn't pull the trigger on it. But for twelve fifty, you can't go wrong. I'll, I'll probably have that as one of my number one gym shirts um, that I wear, and I wear it around the house, and uh, I'll be glad that I'm gonna wear it. Um, from there, we're gonna go um, to this one. We'll just we'll just stay with it. Um, I think I'm gonna give that one the main event slot because that probably is the one shirt that I wanted more than anything else. Oh man, seems a little bit messed up on this one. I don't think it's gonna be horrible. I think if I just you know take some scissors, oh it already came out because sometimes you you pull on that. And it takes the whole seam out of the whole damn shirt. But, um, oh, I opened the wrong one. Hold on. We'll, we'll go to that one next. <laughs> I, I, they're both the same color. Um, I really like these shirts. They really have a really good feel to them. Uh, I'm just honestly going to tell you that I think that, honestly, WWE is just... The, the shirts haven't been as good as they were in a long time. And they just keep running, basically, even with the same guys. The same style of shirt over and over and over again. This one is Ready, Willing, and Gable. Um, down at the bottom, it says American Alpha. Nothing on the back, but this is a great shirt. This is even better than I thought it was going to be. I wanted to buy it, just like I said with the last one, just to support these guys and how much I like it. But the feel of this shirt, is it 100% cotton? This is probably the most craziest thing I've ever done. I can't read, but... This honestly feels like those throwback shirts that I was buying for the longest time, like the, for the weird events like WCW Sin, um, WrestleMania 9, uh, I got a WrestleMania 10 one, Survivor Series, or the old school logos. This is almost like that, where it's got the old school feel. Um, it doesn't feel like this shirt. This shirt isn't rough and tough, but 
It, it It's not as soft as these. These feel like my sheets that I sleep on. So I got the Ready, Willing, and Gable one. That one I was really pumped for. This one, I've been pumped. These guys coming into NXT, they just won the NXT Tag Championships, uh, Gargano and Ciampa. These guys have had great match after great match after great match, whether if it's in tag teams or whether if it's when they wrestled against each other during the Cruiserweight Classic. Um, these are guys that I'm really glad I uh, have the championships, and I'm really glad that I'm able to support these guys. I know that the rumor is that these guys are going to split um, and, and they were really building that up during the Cruiserweight Classic and during the matches against um, the Revival. But now they've beat the Revival. Um, I'm hoping that they can keep going. Even if it means that they just have to keep as a, as, a, as a tag team, always in the chase of that. I really like them as a team. I don't really know what they are not as a team. This feels like huge. This like a, it, is, it says XL, but when I hold it up, I feel like it's going to be like a double or a triple. But really good feel. But just like with the last shirt. You've seen every single guy have this style of shirt. They're ripping off those Mike Tyson and Muhammad Ali shirts um, that are really popular. Um, but I think they've just done it to death. I mean, almost everybody on the roster has one. And this will be the last shirt, um, another one from NXT. Um, this guy is great, and he really caught my eye. The first time I saw him have a match was against Apollo Crews. Um, and I think it was both of their debut matches. Um... And uh, this is a guy that I've really been rooting for. I can honestly tell you that I've gone off on Twitter on this many times that he doesn't win that much, but he's really over the perfect 10. I knew that it was a joke last year that a lot of people wanted to see him debut in the Royal Rumble last year at spot number 10. It seems like the push is even more. Uh, he didn't win an NXT TakeOver Toronto um, against Bobby Roode. I don't think many people thought he was going to. It would have been a huge upset, especially with the way they're booking Bobby Roode to make it look like he's going to be your next NXT champion now that Nakamura's got the belt. Looks like Roode versus Nakamura is going to be your next one. Maybe Joe moving up to the uh, main event. Or not the main events, but moving up to the main roster. Uh, joining either Raw or SmackDown. But Perfect 10, Ty Dillinger. Really, really glad to have your, your shirt, man. This is pumped right there. The numbers don't lie. Um, I, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of this guy. Um, I know that you know he didn't win that much. But he catches my eye a lot. I know it's more than a gimmick. I know there's a lot of fans that like to cheer for this guy. They just go 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. All over the place. But... Um, I'm rooting for this guy, and I want to see him be a star. And um, I know that he was going off on Twitter the other day um, against The Miz. So um, who knows? He's, he's, he's trying to get a, a, a shot at the Intercontinental Championship or just get a shot at The Miz. But the perfect 10 right there, Ty Dillinger. And right here, we've got Gargano and Ciampa. Do it yourself, man. Then we got the two... Ready, Willing, and Gable shirts right here. We got number one. Glad to have this one. I'm going to wear this one a lot. A lot. I thought that I was going to wear this one more. That one's going to be a good gym shirt, but this one, that other one, I'll, I'll, I'll wear it. I'm not even wear it today. American Alpha right there. Love these guys to death, man. Cheer for them big time. Um, singles, tags, whatever it takes, man. They're going to be great. So peace out. I'll see you guys down the road.